How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Video. Today I want to show you how to set an email signature for your email. So whenever you send an email, instead of it saying sent from my iPhone, you can change that to maybe something more professional or something silly or a quote, whatever. I'm going to show you how to do it in a few uh, simple steps. First thing you're going to do is go to settings. And you want to... Oh, sorry. You want to basically go to where it says mail, contacts, and calendar. Tap on that. And then scroll down to the bottom to where it says signature. And we're going to tap on signature. And so right now it's blank. And so what that means is whenever I send an email, I won't see anything at the bottom of the screen. And to show you an example of that, I'm going to go into the mail app really quick. And if I just uh, click here to write an email, right now you see nothing at the bottom, okay? Now, if I was to set a signature, um, maybe I did like, you know, live life like nobody's watching. It's pretty good advice, too. Let's say that was my little quote, and then I put... Uh, George Clooney. I'm being silly. I don't know if that was him or not. I probably spelled his name wrong too. But anyway, just to show you an example. So now that's set. If I just go back to mail, now that's that'll be my new signature. So if I go to the uh, mail app, let's see. I'm gonna cancel this. I'm going to start another, uh, see, and there it is. Now that signature will show up every time you send an email, okay? So that's kind of cool. So maybe if you wanted to be like, you know, this is Joe something, and my number is this, and my email is this. Like, if you wanted to be professional or whatever, it's not something you have to put in every time, okay? So that's kind of how you set that up. Um, and again, if, if, you, if you just don't want to say, maybe you don't want to have an email signature at all, you would go into here and you would just clear it and then go back and then now I won't say anything when you send an email. So let's just show you a quick example. I shouldn't have erased it. Oh watch this. Let's see if it lets go back. There is a it actually won't let us do it. There's a, a feature when you check the iPhone it actually lets you undo what you typed. But um I think since I went back after I um erased it it was too late. So we'll put um Let's see. This is what I think I have on my email. I have a little squiggly line. I put innovator. Innovator, motivator, and I don't know, try to think of something deep. Nothing's gonna me right now. Innovator, motivator, persistent, yada yada yada. We'll just do those three. Okay? Let's say I'm, that's my new signature. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to mail and I'm gonna like start writing so let's cancel this and then we'll start writing a new email. And now there's my new signature. And so now I'm gonna put hey, how's it going? I wanted you to see what it looks like when you send the email. So I'm going to email myself here. Hit send. And now I will check for new emails. And if I go to that email account, there's the email I just sent. And this is what it looks like. So there's what the, the message and then there's a signature at the bottom. Okay. So pretty cool. Um, definitely for business people, you know, uh, usually when you work for a company that you you always have like a default email signature set up that says something about who you are so something cool to set up for your phone and again it's cool I mean you don't always want people to know you're sending emails from your iPhone so it could be more of a business decision like oh you know I don't want them to know I'm sending I'm replying from uh, from home from my phone you know what I mean um, now you may have one question, this is a question I had that unfortunately is not available. Um, you can't set different signatures for different emails. That's the only downside with 
the current iOS software, let's say if you have a business email address, and you have a personal email, that signature is going to be the same for both. Okay, so unfortunately you can't change that right now, but maybe in the future they will allow you to uh, maybe set a personal signature for each email account. So anyway, um, that's the video in a nutshell. Hope that was helpful. If you found that helpful, can you uh, like the video or give me a thumbs up? I'd appreciate it. Subscribe to H2 Tech Videos and keep watching. Have a good one.